Good morning guys, welcome to Life with Lena, and if you guys are new here, please click that red subscribe button down below, and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. So, we started off my morning by editing a vlog, but now we are heating up some quinoa pancakes, they're still frozen though, so back in the microwave they go. I was also just working on um, updating my resume because I do want to apply for some teaching jobs. I don't know if I'll get anything for this coming school year as of September because it's already the end of July. But I did see like a recent listing for like some place in my area that they were looking for a teacher. So I'm trying to update my resume, my teaching resume, so that I can apply and look for a job, you know. Um, that would be progress. <laughs> so... Even though I don't have my official like certification yet, I did finish my master's, so I do have all that and everything, and most places will let you do your certification, like complete that later, as long as you have your master's and you're still working on like your EdTipa, which I am, and I'm planning on submitting by August 17th, like that's the next submission date. So I want everything done by August 13th, and then have that time to like upload all the documents into um, the computer and then submit that. But, um, yeah, we're doing everything a little bit late, but I'm hoping that maybe I'll be able to get like a teaching job, but who knows guys, who knows. Anyway, I got my heated up quinoa coconut milk pancakes. That's another thing we're going to be doing today is making some more of these pancakes because I'm only down to two in my freezer. Um, and Andre always keeps bugging me about these pancakes. He's like, oh my god, they're so good. So I was thinking of making two batches of those pancakes, one for me and one for Andre, so I could freeze them and then Andre could freeze them and then he could have them whenever he wants as well. So I think that's what we're going to do today. I was also going to do a video on it because these pancakes are just seriously so delicious and they're healthy on top of that, which makes it even just that much better. So totally thinking of doing a recipe video on these. Okay guys, starting to make my coconut milk quinoa pancakes, just um, making some quinoa first because you need cooked quinoa for the recipe. And while that's cooking, I'm going to go take a quick shower. Yeah, that's, that's the plan right now. Well, this sucks guys. I can't even do my coconut milk quinoa pancakes. I made the quinoa and I'm looking for my coconut milk and it looks like I'm out of coconut milk and it's not like I could go get any because my mom has my car because hers is still in the shop. So can't do anything anymore and I can't make it tomorrow because tomorrow I'll be working on Edtipa all day so I don't know when I'll finish making it but I want to make it within a couple of days so that the uh, quinoa doesn't go bad um, so then I could freeze it because that's what I always do I freeze it afterwards but damn this sucks okay guys I'm about to start working on some orders but I want to show you guys because I just walked to Mr. Kuba and I got a package in the mail from Aaron Condren it's supposed to be the hundred dollar gift card that I ordered as well as the new pouch that I'm trying to use for my laptop, but I got a different quote this time, so maybe this one will fit better because the other one was just way too big for my iPad, and I like looked at the measurements and stuff anyway, but it was just too humongous. So, let's see. I got a gift. I should have a gift card this time in this package. Oh, here's my um, pouch thing. Oh, I think this one will fit. Oh my god, this one will fit perfectly with the iPad, so definitely get the smaller one. Um, like, even even with the measurements that I looked at on their website, like, the smaller one just works so much better. And I decided to get a different quote. This one is actually one of my all-time favorite quotes. It says, go confidently in the direction of your dreams, live the life you have imagined. And I got a black one, just in case it gets dirty, so, like, you can't tell. <laughs> you know, you know skis, guys. Oh, how do I take this off? I'm so excited to start using my new pouch for my iPad. Woo woo. It smells so chemically though. Oh my God, it smells terrible. Oh my God, I wish I could like wash it or something and I don't know if I could. But anyway, my iPad should fit perfectly in here. And it does. Hey, girlfriend. My iPad is all safe and sound in here. That's perfect. I love it. Okay, and then I did get the $100 gift card with some weird bow tying skills. It's like a floppy bow. Okay. Well, this should be a $100 gift card. Should be. I think I should trust them on it because they taped it up and everything. So hoping this is a hundred dollar gift card. 
I do think I'm just gonna throw this in the wash and try to wash it. I'll probably do it like, I don't know, inside out because it smells so bad, so terribly chemically that just putting my iPad in there for a couple of seconds, my whole iPad smells all chemically now. Like, I, I, it's, it's really bad, guys. Actually, I don't think the print is gonna come off. It's really printed on there. So I'm just gonna throw this in the, oh my God, it smells so bad. Oh my God. Okay guys, gonna work on some orders, but I gotta change the blades because I've been using the blades for cardstock. So I'm gonna put the cardstock blades on the side and that way I will always have them when I, wait, which one? I think that one was up here. Just gonna put them like on the sides and then use new blades for the stickers otherwise the stickers may not cut all nicely and fabulously so yeah okay and then this machine I think that one is okay on blades got my nice stash of blades right here woohoo okay these um, light ones the white ones with the blue tops why can't I open this these white ones with the blue tops are supposed to last like three times longer um, but I'm gonna try to use up these other ones that I have so we're gonna put in some blue ones and then we have to do like a test cut before we start cutting with stickers and yada 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 I hate this process but you do what you gotta do am I right or am I right loves his toys. <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? You crazy monster. He's out the door. Where are you going? And back this way? Give me, give me the toy. Give me. Hey, he let go. He let go. I can get it. of wine I'm almost done working on orders I have like two more I need to complete but again the silhouette program is like acting up and freezing and I can't do anything else so I've been watching offspring on my iPad right here um, with my headphones on because otherwise you can't hear anything with these machines running if you don't have any headphones on so I got my headphones but if you guys know how can I get like this repaired you guys see this how can I get that repaired it's like the seams like I don't know um, I don't know how to fix that I don't know where I would even go they're from Apple but um, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't even know where to go to fix those so yeah that's what I'm doing guys I'm sorry I haven't updated you but I've literally been working this whole entire time but I'm almost done so I'm happy about that and it's 907 so I should be done um, I'm thinking maybe by 10 10 30 ish hopefully with the stickers and then i could print some labels we'll see Hey guys, it's 11.04 and I just finished up working on all of the orders. I actually packed them all up and everything. So I finished probably like around 10.45 cutting everything. I said 10.30 but it ended up being like 10.45ish and I have my bag here full of a whole bunch of orders. These are going to be going out to the post office tomorrow. I'll drop them off. Also tomorrow I was supposed to go to Hunter in the city but like... I feel like I've been driving to the city so many times this week and I really just don't feel like driving there again. So I told my bestie that um, I really don't feel like driving over there. So she said maybe we would meet during the week like in my area instead or something. But I still want to work on my Atipa tomorrow. 
Maybe I'll go to Starbucks. I don't know. Depends on how many people are going to be at Starbucks. There's been times where I've been there where it's been really nice and I got like a table and it wasn't super crowded and I used to get a lot of my work done at Starbucks. But other times, especially on weekends, like tomorrow is Saturday, other times it's really freaking crowded and noisy at Starbucks. So it really just depends. Maybe I'll just Maybe I could even just do it here in my office. I don't know, maybe lock the door or something. I have no idea, but I do want to work on my Atipa thing tomorrow. It would be a little easier to do it in my office though because I'd have my one computer plus my laptop and I could like refer to things on the computer instead of having like a whole bunch of different like papers lying out around everywhere, but I do have the space for papers, but it's just hard to do everything on one computer screen when it's not that big, especially on my laptop like I've been trying to do. So especially, so it would be a lot easier to even do all of it on like my iMac, I guess, on like a bigger screen. But since I started on my laptop, I'm going to continue on my laptop. It's just that looking on like the Atipa manual, for example, would be easier to have that on my computer screen already, you know, just waiting for me to refer to. But we shall see, guys. I don't know. But I am gonna go to bed. I am tired. I have cramps. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for my whole entire night. I know it was like a whole entire work day, but it's good. I got a lot of stuff done, or I mean, I got all the other, I got all the orders done, which was the goal for today anyway. So, anyway, guys, I will see you tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please click that red subscribe button down below if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and I'll see you guys tomorrow in tomorrow's next daily vlog. Bye!